Good morning, Pajama Grandmas. Sharon Hornellstrom here, Pajama Grandma, and I have a very serious topic to discuss today and question for you. Do you or anyone you love suffer from R, F, B, yes, the dreaded resting bitch face? I have been known and been a sufferer of RFB for decades. And it was brought to my attention that RFB is affecting billions of women in this country. Are you a sufferer of RFB? If so, comment and post a picture of your best RFB below. I will post mine because I have several of them and I don't want anyone to think that I am faking the RFB syndrome in my life. So you might be thinking, what the heck is RFB, Sharon, and how do I know if I have it or not? Well, <laughs> look in the mirror. RFB stands for resting bitch face. and. I indeed was a sufferer of a resting bitch face for decades in my life. And it was because I was living a life that wasn't congruent with who I am and what I should be doing and what I want to be doing in my life. And that meant since I wasn't doing what I wanted to be doing, I had a bitch look on my face and a scowl and extra wrinkles because of it for years. And it was brought to my attention by friends and family because they would say they'd see me driving around my small town and I would just have such an angry look on my face. And the other night we were at uh, a soft opening for a new restaurant and everybody's there having a wonderful time. And there's one woman in a corner booth and my daughter was facing her. And she finally, as they're getting up to leave, commented that this woman had the worst case of RFB she'd ever seen. And that just stemmed a whole conversation about resting bitch face. And I don't know why I thought about it this morning when I woke up, but I started to think about it. And I noticed that, all right, I still probably have RFB when I'm working on my computer and trying to figure things out some days or sometimes. But for the most part, I don't, I don't go around looking like a bitch all the time. I don't go around feeling like a bitch all the time. And I credit that to my ability to live my pajama grandma lifestyle and do what I love from my home the majority of the time. And, and a lot of times, I'm in my pajamas doing it, people. I'm doing coaching calls in my pajamas. I'm building websites in my pajamas, or funnels, they're called. I don't build websites anymore. I do funnels for businesses and for people I, I like to work with. So, share in the comments below a picture of your best resting bitch face. Because you'll look at it. And it'll make you smile and laugh and you'll think, oh my God, is that what I really look like to the outside world and to other people? And that was enough to cause you to make changes, to cause you to ask yourself the, the hard questions that have created all of the times that you're having RFB. So let's join together to eradicate this incredibly destructive syndrome because it doesn't just affect us. It affects our families. It affects everyone around us. Please share your picture today and let's see what we can do to eradicate resting bitch face once and for all. Bye.